Hello and welcome all, Invisible here with you again, playing the Prince of Persia at the Two Thrones. In the last part, we have managed to reach this place, and in this part, we will be trying to get down there and get the both guards uh, stealthily as much as possible and see if we can survive this fall over here. Which is this is the right way to do this. So, basically, in the last part, we saw the background. And we saw the beauty of the graphics in here and we saw the gardens which is the last place in this game for you to explore and a place in here that we have to wait a minute i cannot descend basically if i descend it will be a, an a, intentional suicide so i believe that it's this way since there is a tree in here this way Wait, not now. Descend a little bit over here. Okay. If we go there, wait a minute. Why do they, did they make, give me all these trees? Other than to use them. Okay. okay. We have here one guard. We have their second guard and third guard and fourth guard. We have one, two, three, four. The other little guard over there will not move at all. This guard over here, that one is moving. That one is moving. I'm not sure if that one is just idling. Anyway. Easy now. No need to be discovered. Okay, those two. I need to study their route. So I can get a better idea how to take them on. Where is that guard watching? That guard is watching over there. This one is coming over here. That one is going just idling over there. With his face over there. We have a search over here. This guard is just moving for, forth. Uh, there. Coming and going. Not yet, Prince. We need to study this place. Can we jump over there? Thank you, Prince. Okay, let me see over here. So those both are just idling around. Um, this guy over there will just keep patrolling from... You know, Prince, thank you. This guy over here will keep just patrolling from here to there. This one is going to just to keep patrolling from there to there. And this one is going to keep idling as well as that one. So in short, if I took this out, this one out, and that one out would be good. However, if I can take this one out, then that one, without being noticed, after that one, that one may be the last one for me to take out. But can I take this one out and that one out at the same time? That's the question. Sorry about that I'm talking too much and planning my moves, but I don't want to get... Um, my plans are not, not worked. Can I jump backwards over there? Because I doubt it. Listen. No, Prince. Thank you. Okay. Okay. So this is just. Do they want me to take out this one? Then those two. Come on. Good night. Easy now, easy, 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 easy now. No need for that guy over there to see me just yet. Just yet. Easy. I took one out. Those two are the next ones. I cannot just let... Wait, wait, wait. Take them out. Good night. Go back. Hide back. Okay, that one is next. Just keep it down. Keep it down. Keep it down. Keep it down. When this guy goes over there, we'll go to that one on the left. Easy now. Easy. Easy. If I feel that I cannot do it, 
I can just simply do this. Take him out. Die. Now. Go there. Nicely done. Nicely done. Now, wait for this guy over there. Thank you to idle away. Take him out. Good night. And that's, my friends, how you plan a successful stealth attack. You need to study the patterns of the patrolling, how they are moving, and you will know, need to know how and where they are looking. Hmm. And you want right now to tell me that this is going to be only temporary. Right? Because I will have right now to use this tree over here. I'll have to run the wall, jump over this tree, go over there, again over there, then I'll have to jump over there in order to be able to use that tower over there. As I think. It's about my accent, but I'm just, as I told you, my throat. I'm not real sure what kind of accent right now I'm using, but it doesn't really matter as long as I'm playing, does it? If it's offending anyone, I'm real sorry. Okay, looks like this one is permanent. Whatever. Jump over here. Go left, jump over here. Now go right and go over there. Okay, go over here. Move it, Prince, please. I took six minutes to plan out my attack. Still, I took them all out. Right. Which is nice. Come over here, jump your way over here. Now climb over here, which is quite nice. My neck is quite hurting, and my legs are too are healthy, are hurting because I am sitting down in a crawling position. In order to be able to commend myself, Prince, I would, didn't mean to press circle. I meant me, to. What do you believe it is to be a warrior? It is the hunger for power and to seek solution with the sword. Do you disagree? Had you asked me when we first met, I would have said the same. Now, I'm not so sure. Think on it. Dark Prince, this is all wrong. The real warrior is someone that fights for the good, for the major good, that cares about the others, that wants to save everyone from every, every danger, wants that someone that is ready to sacrifice himself for the sake of the ones that he cares about. That's a real warrior. One that cares about the honor of his own and the ones who are precious to him. Not only the one that kills mindlessly. Thank you for not ruining this all out. Now we'll have to think again of a strategy. But I think that we'll have <coughs> we'll have to keep it this for the next time. Sorry guys, but I'll have to end this video over here. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you learned how to make successful stealth attacks. I hope I don't ruin this one. Because then my cycle of successful stealth attacks will be totally for no good. Now, I will leave you. So, best of luck. Alt slash.